Hi everybody! There is a reason why this place is called the Indian Grinding Rock State Historic Park. And this is the evidence. A grinding rock. What is the grinding rocks used for? I mean, there's this slab of rock, but then why are there holes in it? Well, the woman gathered these acorns for the food and then because they could not eat solid acorns, they decided to crush them into mush. So they grabbed sticks, you know, and then basically put these acorns into the dugout holes and they started to mush them until they had a pretty good acorn mush. It wasn't solid, it wasn't liquid, it was perfect. And after some enhancements, they could eat it. And for the morning, they enjoyed it with berries and stuff. And for the evening slash night, they enjoyed the mush with, well, deer meat or any meat they hunted. As you can see, this is the biggest and most important slab of grinding rock, rock in the whole North America. And it's a wonder that I can see this right here and now such an important architectural landmark. It's so well protected because after all of these years, it must be very weathered. And so if kids and pets were allowed to step on it, then by now it'll be mush itself and we all want to protect such an important and historical landmark, don't we? <laughs>